Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, and I'm thinking of them. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me? Was your sluttiness... Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. You watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, if that's how it's gonna be... Yes? <coughs> yes! So, it says here, to communicate with the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since... You're a recent convert. Why don't you be our medium for today? Okay, uh, is anyone there? Hello? Pick up the phone, spirit, spirit phone. Um, abracadabra. Come on. Um, if you can hear my voice, give us a sign. Yeah, like a peace sign or a Guys, stop sign. If you're not gonna take this seriously. Okay, okay. Is anyone there? Wherever there is. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear it's just moving. Holy shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know. What does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. How can we help you? <laughs> it's moving again. Whoa. What's it spelling? War. It's moving fast. Warning. Shit. Oh my god. Warning? I think we uh, really need to find out who's trying to communicate with us. What are you warning us about? Oh. oh, here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Whose sister? Oh, come on, is this for real? Shut up. Ask it whose sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well, which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. Are we speaking to Hannah? Is that you? Oh, God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh, are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. Hannah, we miss you. And we want to know what happened to you. Can you, can you tell us what happened? B? E? T? R? Uh-oh. I don't like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Oh, it, it's still going. Oh, God. K? I? L? L? E? D? No! Kill. We didn't kill them. It was just a prank. Ash, calm, calm down, okay? Just, we, we, we 
need to find out more. I'm sorry. I am guys, so guys, sorry. What, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. Okay. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library here? E? R? O? O? Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library? Oh, no. ah! Holy shit. Chris? You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen. I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board! Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need fault. this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Should we go after him? Ah, man, I, I mean, he'll be okay. Let's, let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if, if, if you were faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Yes? <coughs> Jess? my life? Jess? Buddy, you in there? <laughs> ah! Whoa! Christ! <sighs> I scared the blue out of my jeans. <laughs> the hell is that doing in there anyway? Jess, where did you go? This is not funny. Jessica, oh, come on. I totally promise I won't murder you when I find you. Oh! Oh my god. No. <laughs> that was so good. No. Wait, wait, wait. You have to see this. You have to I'm not singing. Like that. No. Right. No. You recorded that? <laughs> Look at your face. <laughs> I was scared, Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm sorry to I'm scare you. If we send that to anybody, you know what? Gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you scared the pants off of them. As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you're strapped in. You're about to feel the full force of my mind-melting thrill skills.
Was it someone screaming? No. No. Uh, probably just a squirrel. Creep town. <laughs> Charming. It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. underestimate my culinary jobs. Hey, bud. Oh hey, buddy. God, the poor thing. It's okay. It's okay. Oh. It's okay. Mike, it's in so much pain. It'll be over soon. Okay, buddy. It'll be over soon. Ah! Ah! Run! Run! Oh my God! What the hell was that? I don't know. Oh, there's a friend. Over here! Over here! Mike, get over here! Oh.
go! I am! <sighs> Mike, get the key! Get it open! <gasps> Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. I've seen them open car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay. Well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is going to open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. Huh. Typical. Arr. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a bit drafty or something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Mike. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. My lady. Nice. This will lighten up the mood a little. Oh! Ah! Hey, what, are you okay? What are you doing? It's, it's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. But it's probably faulty wiring or something. You've got faulty wiring. I suggest you get a fire going, pronto. Oh, hell yeah. These guys were inventive. Whoa. I'm not sure if I'm ready for such advanced levels of game play. in there, Mike? Come on. It's so cold in here right now, my tongue will get stuck to your flagpole. Gone. My freaking phone, Sherlock. Can you find it? 
Crap, no. I must have dropped it outside. Oh. Shit. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll have you look for it. It's gotta be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. <sighs> Fine. I just wish you hadn't gotten me completely soaking wet trying to scare me. Kind of a dick move. I'm sorry, Jess. Probably fell out in the water and doesn't even work anymore anyway, so whatever. Hey, I'll make it up to you. I promise. Looky, looky. Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? Oh, Jess! Look at this! Is it a fire? No, way cooler. understand what we have together. to meet the friendly neighborhood terror bears. That does not make me feel any better. Take care of the mood lighting. Man one, fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What? comes next? I think... Well, I, I wish we had some booze. Uh, well, uh, if I'd have known that ahead of time. I don't know, I'm, I'm kind of just, I'm not feeling it yet. Maybe we just need to jump into it. You know, like jumping into a swimming pool. What? Maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Seriously? Did you think that would work? Always has before. <sighs> Dick brain. Mike, the shutters. What about them? Um, close them, please? <laughs> There's just no one out there. <laughs> I feel like someone's watching us. I don't like it. Yes, really. It's fine. <laughs> I really don't like it. Okay, shutter it is.
Voila. Shutters are shutted. Now, where were we? I'm sorry. I, I, I'm sorry. I think I'm a little freaked out, and it's hard for me to, like, keep this up, and... What? Keep, keep what up? Look, I act all super confident and like a total sexy babe and everything, but underneath, I gotta be honest, I'm really kind of insecure. Jess, you've got to be kidding me. What? You have nothing to be insecure about. Oh. <laughs> You have no idea. Sure I do. You're just like me and everyone else. We're all insecure. But you know how to handle yourself. You might call it a front, but it's real. Yeah. I guess I do. Yeah. And that's super fucking hot. Really? Yeah, hell yeah it is. See if you can find a blanket and maybe we can snuggle up a bit by the fire and... Sort out exactly how big of a dick you are. Okay. Well. The blanket. Right. Blanket's coming up. It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know. It just came through the window. Oh, for fuck's sake. God damn it. What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us and just when we were getting down to business. Because Michael and I are gonna fuck. That's right, we 